Let's cover how to create a direct invoice in an SAP S4HANA system. Direct invoices are created in accounts receivable using transaction FB70 or the application menu path accounting, financial accounting, accounts receivable, document entry, invoice. Enter the company code you want to post the invoice to in the screen that appears. Click the check mark icon to continue or press the enter key. The enter customer invoice screen will appear. In the basic data tab, specify the mandatory fields. For example, customer number, invoice date, posting date, invoice amount, and tax amount if applicable. Select the calculate tax checkbox if needed and so on. The payment terms and baseline date fields are automatically populated from the payment terms field in the payment tab. The other fields are optional and can be filled in if relevant. You can also enter the GL account as a revenue account in the items area. In the payment tab, define the payment terms, which refer to the conditions settled for the invoice payment and the baseline date, which refers to the date from which the payment applies. You can also fill in the other optional fields, such as CD, which refers to the cash discount amount, CD base, which refers to an amount eligible for cash discount, payment method, invoice reference, and so on. The other tabs also refer to optional data that can be filled in depending on the specific case. After you've entered the required data, you can click more and then simulate to check if there is any error before you post the invoice. If the simulation is successful, an overview screen will appear with overall information. In the next step, you need to click on the post button to post the customer invoice document you receive a message with a new document number at the bottom of the screen. You can display the document created by clicking Path More Document Display to arrive at your created invoice. The corresponding SAP Fiori app is called Create Outgoing Invoices, FB70. It's visually and functionally the same as the SAP GUI transaction.